I remember in our first traditional animation class when we were sophomores, you were showing us your sketchbook and talking about like <coughs> sketchbook um, discipline and, and, and continuing to draw. And those characters kept popping up of Claire, Humberto, and Piper. And then somebody in class asked, you know, wh who are these characters? And you were then you talk just a little bit. It's like, oh, that's that's for my short film. Mm -hmm. I can't talk about it. <laughs> you were just very short and curt about it. And I, I still remember sitting there hovering in that little room, looking at your sketchbook and seeing those early sketches and just being intrigued by it. And it was it was exciting to hear just, it was like our first, like a couple weeks in, but hearing that you had this project going, that you were working on something outside of just showing a bunch of kids what to do and how to, and teaching us stuff. It's a way to fight hypocrisy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. It was like I would tell people like, do this, this, and that. And then I'd go home and I'd try to practice it and I'd remember how hard it is. Mm -hmm. I'd be like, okay, I need to go a little bit easier on them. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> it just helped me not be such a hypocrite. <laughs> I would take some things I'd work uh, on for you home, and maybe I'd struggle through it. There were times I definitely did, but you know, you'd sit down and help me with it, and it helped me like understand these simple animation concepts. But it just really inspired me and like taught me I can do it. All through my career, like as an artist, people said, oh, you're so good, you know, just giving me these compliments. And like, I felt like I hadn't earned them. And when I got into your class, like you wouldn't tell me I'd done something right if I hadn't. It's like, that felt good for you to say like, no, do it again. And I'm like, oh, I can prove it. I can do better, I can do better. <laughs> and like animation was one of the first things art wise I encountered that I was not good at at first. Mm -hmm. Like I'm so used to just like picking things up naturally and animation was not that for me. Right. So it just felt good like, when you finally said to me one day, like, that's good, Paisley, it was like, oh. <laughs> Like, I had to work for it. It just felt good to work that hard. That was like the Piper Humberto thing. Yeah. It's like, I feel like that was a value of mine that I couldn't sacrifice. It's like, mm -hmm. I can't tell them it's good just because I want them to keep going. Yeah. It's like, I got mm -hmm. to, like, you know, put flame under their feet. It's got to hurt. <laughs> yeah. And then if they run fast enough, I'll go, okay. Yeah. <laughs> 